hello lovely people welcome to my kitchen today on our challenge we are going to have some goat meat pepper soup please if you have not yet subscribed consider subscribing and so we have our goat meat here well cleaned and washed we are also going to make use of tomatoes and some turkey berries garlic and onions pepper ginger and some two medium size of garden eggs we are also going to make use of some white pepper and we are going to make use of our mixed spices and this is natural mixed spices that is rosemary bay leaf and other natural spices okay and so what i'm going to do is i'm going to boil my tomatoes my pepper my garden eggs the turkey berries and some of the onions i'll add one more onion to it and add water to it and take it to fire for it to cook and so we are going to blend our ginger and garlic we are also going to add some pepper to it as i said it's pepper soup yes and i'm slicing my onions and adding them to it. so I, I added two onions to it i'm adding my natural mixed spices to it and then i'll add water and blend everything together yes and then so what you are going to do at this time is to add chopped onions to our meat our goat meat then we'll give it salt what you need at this point is a lot of salt and so this salt i'm adding is the only salt i'm going to use in my soup it is very necessary you add enough salt at this stage so that you can get the meat well coated with salt you need this steak to be salty and so when you get it this way it makes your meat taste very good and when your meat tastes good at the end result is having a very nice soup it tastes very good and so make sure you get the initial stage salty so we are adding one teaspoon of our mixed spices to it and then our blended ingredient to add it to it and mix everything together very well so i'm just adding water to it so you have to mix everything together then we are going to take it to fire and give it enough time for it to cook very well i'm going to cook this for the mixture on it to be dry like in a stew form because i want to get some enough oil in 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 my soup so i'm going to cook this this still is still not dry and so i want to get more oil and so i'll allow it to cook more cook more so i realize that it's turning into stew from yes just like this and so if you can check it very well you can see that i have enough oil there so this is it you see enough oil and you know keto oil is very good for us so this is natural oil so this isn't bad at all and so this is exactly what i wanted to achieve and i have and so we have already boiled our ingredients they are cooled down so the next thing you are going to do is pour everything into our blender and blend them very very well okay so after blending i added water to it and i'm straining it you can decide not to strain and add everything to your meat that is okay by you but for me i just wanted to strain it and at this point i'll add more water to it in ghana when we say soup we mean soup so this is pepper soup just as the name means soup so i'll add more water to it and get it very liquid or very light like we say light soup <laughs> okay and so that is it how i'm straining everything please if you are here and you have not yet subscribed consider subscribing and if your aim is to lose weight then just start watching the videos from day one and you definitely get the add flat tummy water to it check the description box for how to make flat tummy water and don't forget to add exercise and so this is our soup you see how liquid it is yes this is exactly what i'm talking about and so you're going to allow this to cook very well we're just going to cover it with the lid and allow 
it to cook give it enough time to cook very very well so we are checking on our soup and as you can see yes it is getting there little by little yeah yeah <laughs> And so I'm going to lower it and cover it halfway and allow it to cook slowly so that I can get in much of the oil on it or on the surface. So that's what I'm going to do. I need the oil for keto, <laughs> you know, you understand. As I said, this is natural, so it isn't bad at all. So we'll lower it and cover it halfway. Okay, we are checking on us. So finally, our goat meat pepper soup is ready as you can see the oil the surface everything tells that the soup is fully cooked it is fully cooked and so you can see my oil the way i want it it is fully fully cooked there's no excess water in them and so our soup is ready and now we can serve it and drink it that is it. <laughs> if you want to add swallow to it, I beg you, you can add keto swallow to it. So check the description box for how to prepare keto swallow. But you know, this is a challenge, so we are not adding swallow. Thanks so much, my dear. This is our goat meat pepper soup. If you have not yet subscribed, consider subscribing, like, share the video, watch out for another recipe. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Send me straight the way I'm my man. I saw me boo, I saw me boo.